So what, wait, what, what are we doing here? I'm drinking water, one second. Okay. That line's getting hydrated. Uh, Tim, what are we doing here? Oh my god, uh, <laughs> I, I heard that there was a square conference and so we're gonna watch it and it's gonna be a lot of fun. And it was gonna happen in 11 seconds, but then you, t you cause you're a time lord, you've stopped I, time. I did. Which is very I impressive. Did. Let us resume time. Whoa, whoa, at 10. Persona! Oh my god, that's so loud. That's so Persona. Yes, it absolutely is. Wait, did we say there's a Square Enix? Yeah, so there is a there was a Square Enix. Um, what did they call this thing? It's not a direct. It's uh, not a, it's a, a digital state presentation, of play. I guess. Sure, sure, sure. Square digital presentation, mm. and we're gonna watch it. Yay! And you're gonna watch it with us. You're I'm gonna watch so us watch excited. it. Excited. Gameplay footage. I hope they show Final Fantasy VII. It's been so long I since doubt that came they out. They will. Whoa! Instead, it's a bird. We live in fear. The anomaly storms have forced us underground. Running from a planet that considers us prey. What? I Is like the big the spider too? on the mountain. That's man, that would be a very <laughs> right. dark turn. That's a jump. I would love that actually. Oh shit! I got. I'm turning this up. That is a pretty bumping soundtrack. Yeah, I did not expect this. And there he goes. Yeah, you think he's bye. gonna be in the sequel? Yeah, he'll be fine. Okay. Wow. Whoa, okay. Very, very Cloverfield-esque. Yeah, yeah, like a gangly, super tall AT-AT. AT. Mm -hmm. Do you think this is all gonna be like pushing PS5 technology? Oh, fuck you, it's not a Sony thing. Maybe it is. But I mean, like, it's a Square <laughs> Enix thing. Yeah, and true, Square Enix enough. is Whoa. very much a Sony company. We are outriders. Outriders. Okay. I, I heard about this demo. Uh, when it was a demo. Like, uh, Did you? Yeah, it's like a... Uh, I, I got it sold to me as Skyrim and Fallout, but... Not that good. Uh, but it was a demo, uh, okay. so... Shit happens. Oh, Fair enough. That, uh, that impalement through the chest, I think... It was, <laughs> I was listening to a podcast and they said, That's right, it, ha that happens, and then it says, Choose your class. Okay. <laughs> like a little pop-up oh, nice. comes up. You. you didn't die. It's fine. You're okay. You've just been impaled. And the world premiere of a new entry in one of our award-winning franchises. This is you stay tuned until this is so Persona Five. Like, what the hell? This is Square Enix presents. And I guarantee you, there will be nothing Persona no, related. No, no, they just took the red from the not, logo and ran with it. Yeah, that's not uh, this company. It's four pixels of red, and they won't stop. Oh boy, there's gonna be a lot of Outriders, isn't there? Uh, I'm thinking, there you go, that's that's it again. Okay, and then it says choose your class from yeah, there? Yeah, just a pop-up menu! So <laughs> wow, amazing. I think you're okay then. Ooh. You think he was choosing his class too? Yeah, yeah. Okay. That's what's on the paper. You wake up in the cart in Skyrim. God! <laughs> What did you do to get uh, arrested? I forget what he says. It's been a while. I think that's what he says. Uh, yeah. I forget what he says. <laughs> it's been a while. A dark original sci-fi universe. Oh, there you go. Created by people can fly. No, they can't. You crazy man. Epic Games Group. Um. Is renowned for developing oh. They made something else. People can fly. Like they said Epic Games, Games Group. Did they? Is this just the Bulletstorm people? Oh. oh my god, it's Skyrim! It's the Skyrim card! This is the fucking people Skyrim can... card! Yes. That's so funny. I'm uh, sure you were mousing away, but I hope you saw that. Made the 2004 Painkiller, as well as uh, Bulletstorm. There we go. Did I say Bulletstorm? Yeah. I feel like I said Bulletstorm. Uh, I think you did, and then you also said Gears of War, uh, Gears of War game. They made Gears of War Judgment. Gotcha. Specifically. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. There it is. There it is. There's a lot of impalement in this. It must be, it's like the JoJo arrow for the 10 million people that get that reference. Yeah. You get shot with it, or stabbed, and then you get to pick. No, you don't get to pick, you just get a power. You unlock your powers. Yeah, or you die. Bad. But I think that's exactly what happens to you. You, you were supposed to die, and then you survive, and you, yeah, you now, get powers. What's all this? What are you, Chris Evans? Sorry, uh, pre-Captain America, Chris Evans. Yeah. 
strolling through the battlefield, yes. the tables have most definitely turned. With the anomaly that's that's a lot of particle effects. That's a lot of particle effects. Discord hates those. Yeah, I will say the textures look really good. You know, and if that's yeah. all like PS5 uh, 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 tech being shown there. Yeah, f uh, frame interpolation. What is it called? Mm -hmm. Image image upscaling. Super yeah. sampling. That's the word. That yes, yeah, super sampling. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, then you know we're looking pretty good. Destiny follows but, Skyrim Gears of War. I mean, that pretty much right? fits the template. Right? Yeah. Do you want to mance some tech, bro? Yes. Yes, always. I do it all day. Oh my god. I can't stop you mancing tech. You make turrets from enemies' bodies. Oh that's, my god. That's kind of great. Yeah, finally, a reason to kill. Yes. To kill more. Cool. Okay. There you go. More right. impaling. All wow, right. they have all a right. fetish. I don't, I don't hate this. No, no, no. I'm not like the biggest Gears of War or, fan, but oh. I gotta tell you, all these powers and stuff do look very interesting. It's, it's what the chainsaw did in Gears of War, but with every other class now. Yeah. It's not just yeah. the gunner. It's the, the, I don't know, Dickromancer. What, what was this one called? Well, that, that was one of the attractions of Destiny. Was that you had yeah. all these different classes that did these different things, but yeah. it looks like these have even a couple more classes than that. We'll see if there's any specialization Subclass. that goes on from there. Do you know, um, it, Diablo, I think, did that one of the best, where yeah. you had your class, and then that class was able to specialize yeah. a bit. To, to like um, hit two sides of the tech tree kind of thing, or maybe three. Yeah, MMOs like do wind. that when they reach a power yep. cap. Yep. They'll usually introduce some sort of sideways, some horizontal progression. Yeah. All right. Now uh, you got two swords, or now you got a sword and a shield, or one giant sword. Right. Do you want to be a restoration warrior, or do yeah. you want to be a, a there you whatever? Go. Now we got uh, the that's that's the extent here. of my WoW knowledge. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not that kind of nerd. No, I am. Yeah, I was. I I totally am. Yeah. Well, was like, but that was I'm off the shit. Stuff. <laughs> Twelve years ago now. Yeah, yeah, it's been a bit. Fifteen years ago since I played World of Warcraft. Probably 2012 for me. Yeah. Almost. 10. I mean, true vanilla. Like, yeah. Burning Crusade and vanilla were pretty much the extent of when I played those kind of games. Wow. But, um, that you can still see the seeds of MMOs in modern games like this. Oh, totally, totally. You know, that's that's why a game like Destiny still only captures me so far yeah. based on other people who may not have come up on the MMO and don't know the trigger signs. It's got the framework. Right, um, that dopamine loop. Yep, 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 yep. As uh, ADD always, boys, we know that very well. Gaining new skins, yeah. gaining new armor, gaining new weapons. Uh, all the armor and weapons look the same at a certain rarity level. What's going on? Do they just forget yes. to design more? No? Okay. Yep. All the beginning armors tend to look very the same. Yeah, well, it's just a bucket. <laughs> it's just a big bucket. I would absolutely play a character who just wore a bucket on his head and just the whole game. Yeah, like kind of like <clears throat> how you'll wear like a like a rain slick coat or like a garbage bag, uh, like as a replacement for a said rain slick coat. You just wear one yeah. big bucket with your head popping out the top, holes in the yeah. side. Just your hands are pop. You, you know, absolutely. Turn your whole body to pick things up. This is all just the tip of the iceberg. I do it. My God, if this is just the tip of the iceberg, I can't wait to see what the rest of this presentation holds. Yeah, I More can't wait to see the shirts. They've shown this logo like 600 times. Okay, pre-order April 1st. You make a joke about it? Oh, yeah. there you go. You can play the demo. Yeah, the the I thing mean, I've that heard is, is that very the story soon. is not that great so far, but I guess that's something we'll see as we play it because we'll for sure play it. Guns blazing and pick well, Tim will play it. Uh, Commit. Maybe. We committed. <laughs> this year marks the 25th anniversary of Tomb Raider. And hey, I know that lady. Yeah, Lara. Did you did you play any of their early early or early Lara Crofters? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I uh, I played like Tomb Raider one or two. It's PS one, right? Yeah. Uh, and those triangle boobies. That one. Uh, were very. Confusing for me. Very poly polygonal. Yeah. Polygonal, if you will. That's the word I meant to say. <laughs> Same word, different country of origin. Yeah. Um, oh, there it is. Does that go? 
collaboration with <laughs> Was that Lara Croft? I think Kraft so. I think so. I, God, ugh. Yeah, that's Square for you. I have not played any of the modern ones, Talk though. Talk about Mommy Milky. Because <laughs> they're milking Laura Cra Anyway. Uh, yeah, me, yes, uh, me yes. Neither. I own the two new ones. Uh, or two of the new ones. Uh, but I haven't played them yet. But they look good. Just Uncharted plus, you know? I... I have seen like the multiplayer mode in one of the new ones, and that looked pretty fun. Yeah, but like other than that, I haven't us. really multiplayer. It, 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 the Tomb Raider series has never really been a one that's interested me too much. Tomb, you know, um, much. Nor has what's the the, the series that ripped off Tomb Raider? Uncharted. Uncharted. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Yep. Uh, I just that's not. Just super big in my in my wheelhouse. That's fair. Uh, I'm more of an Assassin's Creed. Yeah, just like guy. if I'm gonna do that, the run and gun and, and climb and run. Uh, you're more of the sneak and stealth and climb and stealth. And kill. I'm more of the sneak and run and stab and stealth. That's yeah, the one. exactly. Yeah. That's 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 my genre. I don't mind this. I feel like if this hit more of the stealth beats, like again, I have not played them, but uh, mm. <laughs> if it hit more of the stealth beats of combat and less of the. Oh, I'm a college girl that suddenly knows how to do all this shit in the first one. Uh, I mean, I feel like I'd be more inclined to enjoy it, but the I don't first know. Tomb Raider games were haven't given Lara raiding tombs and shooting dinosaurs and tigers and Christ. occasionally people. Yeah, and having to deal Damn. with you know kind of an Indiana Jones style art, but. Uh -huh. I feel like it's gotten diehard no! syndrome. Oh, sorry, Tim. No! Yeah, I know. I know. Yeah. Something fierce where Lara is now like a superhero. Yeah. Instead of an adventurer. She's become John McClane as opposed to Indiana yeah, Jones. Yeah, 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 yeah. The struggle has to be there in some regard. Right. I agree. But so we're bringing some of our most popular sometimes seeing John this McClane has to hurt his feet when he walks through glass. Yeah. Otherwise, it doesn't matter when he actually wins. Yes, yes, exactly. The darkest nights and blah, blah, blah. <clears throat> there is a wonderful observation piece about that when it comes to um, Jackie Chan's action movies. Ooh. And how in pretty much everything he does, he might be the most skilled person in the room, but he's usually hampered in some way. Okay. Uh, He's fighting innocent people that he doesn't want to get hurt. Yeah, he's got yeah. his hand strapped behind his back. There's he's some got handicap. a bomb in his mouth, yeah. like in rush hour. You know, like there is some handicap. Yeah. And when he overcomes that handicap, yep. that's when victory becomes earned. Yeah, there's something to be said about a staggered resolution that if you just Dragon Ball Z your way through with Super Saiyan 10 or whatever the fuck, uh, right. it's not as, as engaging and interesting as, uh, you know, Learning uh, to be a part of the Forza squad. I don't know what the fuck I'm looking at. Bugs Bunny always wins. Yep. That's yep. that's that's part of the rules. Yep. But Bugs Bunny also never starts a fight. Yes. Because if Bugs Bunny always wins and he starts god. a fight, he's a bully. Yes. Exactly. <clears throat> and that's almost worse than a god. Um, hey. So, like, it... it oh, whoa! It's an interesting theory to kind of play with in storytelling of, you know... Either somebody's got to start it, and then your character always wins, uh -huh. or your character always oh, wins, and he man. starts at a handicap. Yes. Yes. Yep. And yes, it is. Oh, man. Is they are now daddy milking this. You've large shoes to fill. Wait. Oh, no. You will need to Hitman is Agent 47. And strike from the she said Agent 426. Uh, was it 46? So this is or 46. This is this is Hitman, but it's not. Yeah. There you go. Working title. Right. It's a multiplayer and also an Fucking, app. Yeah. Oh yeah. I saw the mobile logo twice. Yeah. I was like, wait a minute. That's Hitman. That's the lady of Hitman, but that's not. Yeah. That's not Agent 47. At least she got paid. Like that's. All As someone I'm who's been watching a lot of Hitman playthroughs lately, yeah. that ain't that ain't. He, I didn't see no barcode. They're good. They're good games. I enjoy the jank that comes with those. Yeah, it's a sandbox. Put it that way. That's what I always yeah. say. Yeah. I want to kill someone with a toilet. And Space Invaders you know, it's funny. With all give the, me that. With all the pixel art that I did, I never did anything like Space Invaders or anything with that shape. I feel like it was too easy. That was like your practice. Yeah. Right? You could do it in your head. Like, that's you doing equations in your sleep. Like... 
your pixel arting right, Space Invaders one two, by three mm. by one. But <laughs> damn, so dude. yeah, that's they're going. Hard. I mean, that was a whole like section of mobile games there. I I don't know if it's ended. I don't. Yeah, we gotta play Bubble Double. Think it has. Bubble Gubble. There you go. Yes, yes, yes. You're, I'm in. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately in. Yes! Oh, and then there's yes! the. Yep, there it is. Oh god. <laughs> you got him. I just need S rank cards now. Are there are there rankings? Please, please tell me this music plays while you're playing the bubble. It is Toho Spell Bubble. That's cute. I'm fine with that existing because the people that like that will like that. Is that what do you mean? Fair to you're say? the people that like that. I like to look at everything. I'll say. <laughs> if it's adorable, I like it more. Now see this. I like this. It said free play at the bottom. I like these games. My favorite the super R type are and free Gradius free and, and yeah, Gradius. Um, uh, Blaster fuck, Master. The, yes, uh, and there was one Ikaruga. that began with an R. Ikaruga is a very good one. Isn't that the one where you so switch back good. and forth between black and white? Black and white. Yep. Yeah. Yep. 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 I think it was like Ray Gun something. Dar Darius. Dar Dar mm. Darius. Daria. Sure. That's so uncool. I mean, if it's supposed to be like oh, it's Gradius and Parodius, then it's Darius. Yeah, right? But I don't know. Oh. Bubble Bobble. Mmm. Dino Milky. I mean, don't get me wrong. I don't hate the art style, no, but it's like, adorable. is this. Is this. This is a lot of chaos. This is what the people were clamoring for. And like, when you see those cute little dinosaurs looking like a Kirby, do, do, do. you want to throw some goggles on them. And it looks like you got some retro levels in there too. I, well, yeah. Isn't it? Isn't that a staple of okay. modern retro gaming now? You can just hit the the options button and switch between on the fly retro graphics and modern. Yeah. Sure. Oh, I know them. I know them. Who are they? The team's roster is growing. Welcome, Jeremy Renner. As Jeremy Renner. <laughs> Wait. Oh, Square Enix oh, no fucking did way. make... Yes, yeah. no, it literally is Hawkeye DLC. That's so uh, funny. I forgot that fucking... Ooh. Ooh. Bald Hulk. Yeah. Oh, um, I forgot that Square Enix is the one that made the failure of the Avengers game. Hey, man, like, I was real hyped for that game, and then it came out, and I was like, I suddenly don't care anymore at all. It's Zero. real bad. I, I heard the story was fine. It was a good it's game. It's real But the multiplayer meh. was the saddest... You know, this. Now, this yeah. looks fine, honestly. It's real meh. It's real meh? Yeah. But this does apparently... No additional cost. Uh, ...include some extra stuff. So I'm we still got waiting for Spider-Man. ...a Hawkeye DLC. Future yeah. Imperfect and next-gen upgrade free to all Marvel... Well, look at Hawkeye Punch. Avengers That's owners. what he's known for is his quick fists. Hey, Hawkeye. <laughs> Long time. How's my dog doing? Did he say hot guy? Yeah, he definitely said a hot guy. Didn't you move out today? What? No. What makes you say that? They said they were moving. Also, not Jeremy Renner. No. Thank God. Oh, no. Yeah. Well, none of the Avengers are the movie Avengers. And that's part of the problem. I'm I'm fine with that. I've played many a Marvel game and been sad I mean, sure. that it's not Chris Evans as Captain America, but that didn't yes. force me to buy the 360 game where he's in it. I think I think that was something that people were just marginally disappointed in and made it automatically kind of feel just wrong. Yeah. Was yeah. the Uncanny very kind of thing. strong connection yeah. to the last 10 years yeah. Yeah. of Marvel films that this big company, if they've got the Marvel license, should have just tried to work with Disney, and maybe did, and then wasn't able to do it, um, to get the faces and, and, you know, Like, I feel the like the whole rights. budget for the game was one then paycheck for Robert Downey Jr. Like, I don't think anyone could afford that. Except for Disney. I mean, this is Square Enix we're talking about here. Square Enix might have created the Final Fantasy, but they also... We're forced Created to the make Final, Final Fantasy. Fantasy 7 remake. 
Yeah. So, so I, 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 you know, I don't know where, but all I could say is yeah. what how people felt. And how yeah. people felt Fair. was that it was very weird after getting attached to the last 10 years of Marvel people, yep. seeing different Avengers. That's that's totally fair. And I, especially the exact as a kid, same... always felt that kind of feeling when seeing a licensed property and be like, but that's not the thing from the movie. Well, but it's so, I think the other thing that was weird was that it was the exact same lineup of characters. Yes. Just choose different Avengers then. Yeah, honestly, you know, you yeah. Still, like, still have some of them, still have a Thor or a Iron Man, but like, don't make it the exact yeah. same roster uh, if it's sorry, not going to be the exact same Don't make it the Walmart cast. version, make it its own thing. Correct. You know, make it a different Thor. Make your, yeah, yeah. I, I, I agree with that. There's, there's plenty of Marvel, and they, they kind of did that with the introduction of Miss Marvel. Yeah. But I Kamala? think that, uh, yes, uh, Miss Marvel could have been introduced to a whole new team of Avengers, and people would have been less meh, uncanny yeah. valley about the entire ordeal. I, I understand. I think. Um, I, I, I gotta say, like, from every video, aside from that one Thor video of him in the middle of the quick time event, just pausing because you don't hit the input, um, right. all the motion in these games, or in this game, looks very good. And, like, I, the combat looks so, good. I just don't know how it feels physically. From what I understand, oh, a lot master. of the problems actually has more to do with the systems around the combat. That's fair. <clears throat> And the loot system structure and the uh, way that you the game kind of <laughs> yeah per, the the game part of the game yes um, but that's again mostly hearsay because I haven't played it myself yeah, yeah. Uh, but it is very kind of um, oh what's the mobile game uh, mm. and like the the third person like switch characters game ultimate oh, something um ultimate alliance. Third person switch characters game. Uh, I think it's Marvel yeah, Ultimate. Yeah, Marvel, yeah. I think it's Marvel, Marvel Ultimate, Ultimate Alliance. Alliance. Yeah. That game kind of had a similar progression to what it seems like this Avengers game has, where you've got several pieces of armor, and each of those pieces of armor have incremental upgrades. I and don't know if I remember that. It's in that very game, Borderlands in that way. That much. Borderlands in you, any game doesn't sound good to me, though. Right. In, uh, in 2021. Uh, I will actually lean more towards the borderlands -y version of it rather than the first comparison because that okay. first comparison might be a little unfair. Nah, that's fair. That's to unfair. the other game. See, there you go. Uh, that's what that's what the fucking screen looks like there when you're upgrading stuff. And most of those upgrades are incremental at best. Reassemble uh, campaign. So you're looking at very Borderlands slash MMO style uh -huh. uh, accuracy De plus three percent versus accuracy accuracy plus four yeah. percent on a piece of armor that doesn't have any cosmetic effect on the character. That's the worst thing. Like my yeah. favorite part of an RPG is where you change the weapon and slash armor and it changes on the guy. Yeah, even if it's no longer the set that looks the best, at least you're you're. Reflect your your character is reflective of your choices. Let me wear my fucking bucket armor and let me turn it off if I want. Glamour me, baby. Oh my god, yes. What is? It said Crystal oh. Dynamics. Uh, this is Wakanda. Is this Panther Black? Yeah. It sure is. Are they adding? Oh my What's god! Up, bro? It's the Black Power Ranger. Oh fuck! Love yeah. it. So I guess they're introducing Black Panther and the War for Wakanda oh, expansion coming yeah. later this year. I don't think they've shown, it might be in the law, uh, where you can't show Black Panther without just putting a dope soundtrack in the background. No, it is. It is absolutely in the law. Because that was fucking, that was tight. Okay, so this, Tim, I was we were talking before, um, before the show started here. Uh, the one thing that I got spoiled for me in an email from Square was this um what's the best way to describe it uh nightmare okay i think excellent yeah because this whatever this trailer shows you i just oh wow i just want to tell you ahead of time so it's... you're prepared is all lies uh slanderous lies and the game part yeah that's about it oh that's it that's the whole oh. game okay yep you like clothes? Put them on. <laughs> now. You can, yeah! And 
The running animation it's, is so it's weird. It's awful. It's awful. I got my partner, Davey, who doesn't play games very often to play this, and I was like, oh, God, it's probably just because they, they're not used to playing, you know? And then I picked up the controller when they said, all right, I think I'm done with this. And I was like, wow. You Do you see this dance number? You saw that dance number, Tim? What? That's in the game. Unfortunately so. That's... That's your reward for beating a boss, is a dance oh, number. Oh, so that happens a lot. At least in the demo, it happened once with Farmer Brown there, and that's fucking enough for me. Yeah, that's one time too many. Yeah, this would be a good anime, maybe. Oh, I remember seeing the previews for yeah. this and hating it then. Oh no, they're putting it on all those platforms. Oh, I feel so bad for all those platforms. I know. I was like, oh, maybe the Switch just can't handle it. <laughs> I can't wait for my computer to run that at 10 frames a second. Uh, but yeah, um, that, oh. that game looks frightening. Uh, play it if you hate yourself. This is, uh... But I hope it's good, because the character design This is, uh, the, the, the life is, uh, life is strange. Isn't it? Uh, hmm. I think so. I never played them, but this is, is really giving me that. There we go. We we got a beanie. We got a beanie. Yep. It's life yep. is strange. Defi de definitely, definitely. Oh, we got some. We got some tea lights. This is life is looks strange. Looks like looks like we could be in Portland or Colorado. Oh yeah, my god, it's life is strange. Or Alaska. Yeah, and also suddenly sad. Oh, definitely. And uh, college age students drinking beer. This one's for you. That only happens in Life is Strange, nowhere else. Is it going to be a musical ghost story? Oh my god, you just described my fantasy. <laughs> Those paper lanterns are not good for the environment. But they look so pretty. Yeah, and they're a, a physiological anomaly, but... Son, sit down. Sorry, I'm developing ghost powers. Yeah, one second. Alright, I'm good. <laughs> Where is that? <laughs> That uh, was an all-new twist of the strange. Whoa! Uh, living your best life. We help each other. That is strange. I ran out of mustache oil. Oh, Need geez. you to go down in the mines and get me some. Tim, did... You should know about do they all have Facetune on? Probably. They all look like they have Facetune on. That's cute. Use the power of emotion. I can see these auras around them. Everybody projects colors. Yeah. Your aura is like really giving me jealousy right now. I need to like get you some crystals, maybe some bismuth. That's cute. Do you believe in real things, Tim? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm kidding. Believe in what makes you happy. Uh, but hey, Christology believes in real things. Crystals are real. They're yeah. just you can feel also them. Also, complete and total bullshit. No. Oh. See, told you, life's a stretch. No, yeah, I believed you when I saw the two. True beanie. colors. They spelled colors wrong. No. Ah. Uh, I'm sure it'll be different for your location. I hope so. The next major game in the Life is Strange series, developed by Deck Nine Games. I hope I thought that this is good. I thought that they were making a third, though. I mean, so is this different two coming out before? Uh, Just legally distinct from? <laughs> Maybe? Okay, standalone okay. adventure. Got I could have sworn Somebody got shot. But one and two were the same characters, right? Or am I crazy? Yes. If only we were I didn't culture. play them either. I don't know. Is the definitive answer. Man. The only thing I played was that little mini game. The, okay. the adventures of Captain whatever. Underpants? Captain Underpants. Um, fuck. Ah. Did you do the flip motion thing? Awesome Adventures of Captain Something. Hang on. Yeah, you got this. See, and like, shit like this. Spirit. Captain Spirit. Captain what? The Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit. Captain Spirit. And and how is that related to this in any way? Genuine. Uh, it's supposed to be an introduction to Life is Strange 2. Gotcha. So like, it was a little... Side game that was released before Life okay. is Strange 2 that was sort of setting up like that some of Dead the Space Wii game that like yeah was like a prologue almost um, yeah okay I feel it I like stuff like that because it, it's I assume it's cheap or free mm -hmm. yeah 
Um, but I, I like stuff like this, and, and it's these, we put our heart and soul into this game. That really makes me want to give it a shot. Um, it is what it is. That's a good sticker to have. Or pin? Mm. Or patch. She looks like a patch, I think patch. Yeah. Looks like a patch. On a military bag like that, you patch it. Dude. She duffled up. <laughs> wow. This beautiful mountain town where nothing bad's gonna happen. Hey, nothing bad will happen. Don't you dare until dawn this. <laughs> um, but it is beautiful. I'm, I'm not the one that's making the story. The yes, you are, you fucking liar. Is he an Aries? He had a ram on his shirt. That's not a joke, just an observation. <laughs> that phone's upside down! <laughs> that's not how you use that! <laughs> It allows her to experience it absolutely <laughs> is. <laughs> I hope that's a part of the story. I hope it's like she's she's not actually on her phone. She's just lying, and then you hear the calculator beep boop boop on her face. Key part of the game in very much under your control. Okay, they're talking about her powers here. So okay. shut up. Yeah, this is cool. <laughs> oh, I like that DJ Cash shirt. On her very first day in Haven Springs, Alex meets our cast. This give me Majora's Mask vibes. Which yeah. is weird. Why? Um, like no, not in, why is it weird. Why does it give you majority? Uh, you're mass in the life? town. Uh, you get different perspectives on the same place. I always like that kind of thing. It it, huh. it gives you an excuse to reuse, uh, but but deepen a connection with a location. True. Oh fuck yeah. Captured and animated here in house at Deck Nine. Making this. Why is he speaking into my heart? And the true next generation. Of life is strange. In life is strange, true colors, the mystery. He's so ready to cry. I know, right, right now. After Please buy this. Like, literally, somebody's just got to point at him, and he'll start rolling tears. <laughs> we put our heart and soul into this. To get to the truth. I'm about to piss. It becomes clear that only Alex, using her psychic power of empathy, can uncover cool. what really happened. We can't wait for you to experience I feel like I know it's hokey bullshit to most. Uh, I feel like I'm like some just either either completely supernatural paranormal psychic man with with emotions or just I'm really good at picking up on body language and I know that sounds douchey but like when people are upset, I am so upset and I think that's a genuine problem. But also, it's, you know, it's that makes you empathetic. Yeah. But you can't spell empathetic without pathetic. Oh yeah, I'm a bitch. <laughs> it's very hard for me to go on. <laughs> oh my god, we're still on Life is Strange, this mini game. Well. Oh hell yeah. This is the most college game. Oh yeah, totally. Right? Like, I just got out of high school and I'm taking a year off for myself, which is fine. I took like ten. I'm still taking them. <laughs> and that song is really hard to play because I don't have seven fingers. <laughs> also, the words not vary. Yeah, but this is a kids game. No, it's a college kids game. <laughs> I was about to say, make up your damn mind. Is it a kid's game? Is it a college game? It's whatever fits my point at the moment. Ah, uh, she is in Colorado. I hey. knew it. I fucking called that shit from the beginning. You got it, man. Art walk. All right. I am so excited for this game. And I hope that you're feeling the I'm excited for her. For I <laughs> and now, the big I'm not that game. much, but Absolutely I'm excited for you. That the full game is coming out I hope it goes September. well. That's right. The full game. Dude. You won't have to wait for the rest of the story. You can binge it all at once. Oh, yeah, because they did episodic before. Oh, right. I was like, why is that a big deal? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? You're just going to release the demo? <laughs> that's awesome. And that's very square to have those three editions there. There's and I'm sure oh, she yeah. had no control One over this. more very special thing we've yet to reveal. We're delighted to announce that Life is Strange and Life is Strange Before the Storm oh my God. return in an all-new remastered collection featuring enhanced visuals. I was going to make a joke about that, but then I was like, she's probably going to say it, so I should probably just let her say it. 
But all right. Uh, That's a way for people to get into it. This is very 2005 garage country. Oh, yeah, totally. Wow. Tim, look at your closet. Do you see your flannel? It's glowing. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. God, my flannel is glowing. Amazing. And so I think the big deal is that Life is Strange 3 is supposed to pick up with these two characters that have kind of been left off for a while. On the main line. Okay. Right. But I don't know. So take that with a grain of salt. Yeah, we're speculating based on uh, about five minutes collective of seeing pictures of videos. Right. Over however many years. Long enough to make a remaster. <laughs> I, uh, blah, 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 we don't want to get copyrighted, forgot about that, ah, da, 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 yeah, yeah, love that poster, love that, love that person, look at her, dancing in colors. I love it. It's like paint. But... I'm ready to show you all my angst. I thought True you were, colors. I thought you were going to say anus. No, God, no, kids game. It's purple. <laughs> Teenage game, college game, Cal what is college it? College game. Today, Where are we? Where am I? Team at Luminous Productions. Oh. Ooh, now we got the gold stuff. I don't know what that means. Um, you know, games go dragons, gold. melting dragons. Okay, working title. Project Athea. Hey everyone, I'm Ella Valinska. <laughs> I'm oh, hi, Ella. I'm oh. super excited to finally announce that I play the lead character Frey in working title Project Athea. I hope ah, it's called that. It is Athea. I hope it's called that. A beautiful Keep the working title in there. Yeah, sure, Whoa. absolutely. The development team has been working super, super hard to create this remarkable journey, and it's been incredibly exciting to be a part of it. Frey is a character. This I isn't a bad thing, but she looks like she was generated with one of those like random so face things. With the team to bring her character to life. Uh, yes, you know what I'm saying. And it could be yeah. just because I don't know her, <laughs> and my brain's like, I don't know you. We do have a sneak. But I can't stop seeing that, and, and it might just be digital touching up oh. of the face. So it looks like it looks like we might actually get the proper title for this at the end of this trailer. Ooh. Yeah, it will no longer be Project Athia. It will just be Athia. Ooh. <sighs> Working title. She's got like tennis shoes and a T-shirt on, fighting dragons and shit. Uh, you think? Yeah, you think she's just time portal thing? I don't know. Uh, yeah, is this is this? Monsters came to the present, or is this modern oh. ghosts of the past? Or is this that that uh, timeline blending genre that I love? Yes, timeline blending, <laughs> where it's like, okay, it's an RPG, but you're using baseball bats and yo-yos and things like that, you know? For spoken. This is this is medieval, but also we have T-shirts and jeans because. That Ooh. happened. Whoa. Ooh. Ooh. I do like a good parkour system. Yeah, that went from uh, a five to a 10 real quick. Right? And good bending powers? I'm down. I've bent a few cool. things in my time. Mostly girders. Cool. Thank you for joining us to see what's in store from studios across Square Enix. But there is more to come. No. Be on the lookout okay. For next oh, you... Enix presents ah. this summer. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought they meant right now. I was like, okay, we're ready. We're <laughs> Do ready. Do you oh. remember Outriders? <laughs> eh. 30 more minutes of that. My gravy. Please don't. <laughs> Tim, remember when I pulled a nose hair out and my hand smelled like cookie dough because I had a cookie dough? Yes. I did it again. <laughs> You remember when we saw all those awesome games that we just saw? Well, Wait, we well, didn't you see that? that. Oh, yes, we yeah, did. That was say. just cause mobile. Oh, right. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. You were telling a story. Um, Man. Well, this was um, a presentation. Yeah! I can't wait for Balan Wonderworld. There was some interesting stuff in there. Like, uh, I, I will admit, like, it might not be everything my cup of tea related, but I will be able to admit I see where people might be interested in everything except for Balin Wonderland. <laughs> um, I, I, I think that if this is what Square Enix has besides the next Final Fantasy VII, they're going to do all right. Uh, where's, give me the next Final Fantasy VII, please. Oh, come on. Please. I, uh, I think please. that... 
I, I can have his early copy, please. <laughs> please. Um, don't release paper lanterns into the sky. I'm pretty sure it's bad for the environment, unless I heard that from somewhere false. Thank um, you for watching. No, thank you, Tim. Uh, that The last game looked very cool. Balin Ball in Wonderland. I will probably play because I want to see if it's trash when it comes out because that demo was rough. Yeah, it's, it's barely a game. Oh, try it. Try it. It's free on your Switch. It hurt. It hurt me. Um, what else? Yeah, it was, it was a good representation of, uh, like I've said uh, probably three times already, and, and so did you. Not our cup of tea, but I really hope it's good for the people that like that. You know? Yes. yes. Nothing disappointed me greatly except for seeing the word mobile several times. Right. And probably the fifth I mean, time they sh showed the Outrider logo. It is good to know that people are making double A mobile games. Yeah. You know, that, that it's not all just clickers and pressers. That, that people are actually trying to push what mobile games can be. Uh, I, I appreciate that. And so I'm not going to like poo poo it too hard. I will admit that. It will for comedy reasons, but. Probably not something I'm going to play and or download and or buy. But. That again does not stop me from seeing the value of it. Yeah, totally. For for the audience that isn't me. Yeah, anyway. and, and I I love to hear and see on social media the people that are hard as fuck into that stuff, and they're like, no, I f I fucking love Hitman Go. It's like, whoa, all right, please tell me about it. Can I interview you? Absolutely. Yeah. You're, a, you're a rare little flower, my yeah, little rare tell flower. Me, tell me how your brain is wired, and how can I get that with everything. So, final thoughts for me, Dylon. Uh, I let them all out when it said Square Enix Presents. Tim, final thoughts. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I think I've pretty much gotten all mine out, too. I, I, I think that Forspoken looks like a really cool piece of property. Yeah. I think that for people that enjoy Life is Strange, they're going to like that little side tale. I think that they were expecting more Life is Strange 3 news, like I was. Um, and I'm sure it's coming, I, I was thinking like that there said. would be something. Yeah. Um, but we haven't heard about it in a while, and that's odd. Uh, uh, I'm surprised that there was no Final Fantasy anything, not even like a Final Fantasy 14. here's how we're doing state of the game kind of deal. Yeah, or um, 16. If, is but maybe yeah, or thought. like even just the the current trailer to Final Fantasy 16. Yeah. Um, but other than that, you know, pretty standard offering. I, I don't think there was anything too offensive other than Balin Wonderland, <laughs> and I don't think there was anything too stand out other than Forspoken. So yeah, like I would say that this B. is a yeah, yeah, pretty good middling ground kind of presentation is what we're looking at mm -hmm. here. So, you know, we'll see you back here for the next one, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you all enjoyed watching this. You've been watching it on YouTube.com slash Tim and Dylon. I'm Tim. I'm Dylon. Bye, everybody. We've never done that. That was good. Oh, well, I think you. It's the first time. time for everything. I think, I think that, yeah, that felt good. Six out of ten. Barry Bud. <laughs> Six out of ten. Wood outro again. <laughs>